Okay, this is... You found the grappling hook in... I don't know. This is all items percent, I guess? I don't know. There's not really any categories, because I'm the only one who plays it, so I should have any world records that show up. It's a free game uh, by Messhoff. Messhoff's a really cool guy. He does indie stuff, like Fly Wrench and some trippier stuff. hard game. Uh, it's easy to screw up because the controls are a little wonky. There's a trick right here that's kind of a pain. Uh, really easy to screw up. Uh, these boots let you hover by tapping uh, whatever button you have them assigned to. Mine's on a PS3 game pad, so I have it set to X. Shh. Uh, Messhoff is kind enough in this game to, along with the game itself, include Joy to Key, because he says it just works better with the, the joypad, which I can believe. I like it better. Jesus. It's really easy to screw up with this game, just because you, you control kind of wonky, as I said earlier. Yeah, there's no uh, super cool tricks in this game. Pretty straightforward. Oh yeah, you can... If you tap fast enough, you can go up. Which is nice. That was the pickaxe. Pickaxe is normally used for gold, which you would get. Jesus. They're gonna be bad. I don't even think this will be world arc. That was really dumb of me. Yes. Uh, pickaxe is used for getting gold, which is... Which the story is based on. Uh, 
gold only comes into play during the last bit of the story. You sell it to some dudes. It's cursed, you buy a watch or something, I don't know. Anyways, the boots are just fantastic. Oh yeah, that's not even the end. <laughs> yep, 623. I exit the cave with zero pieces of gold. Uh, yeah, and that's it. I, I guess that's the world record. Hooray. Uh, I encourage others to play this game. It's pretty cool. I'm a huge fan of uh, Messoff and everything he's ever done, so uh, definitely give it a try sometime, it's cool. It's free, I'll make a link in the description, blah blah blah. Yeah, whatever. <laughs>